Okay, y'all, I am here because I got my hot cocoa box. This is it, okay? And this was the Valentine's Day box. And so the items are edible, edible, okay? Um, now, first, let's talk about January's box. Um, let's say, I mean, it was a good box, but it was nonetheless for your face. So you're, if you're in love with your face, it was a great box. But I kind of would have rathered more products, you know, involving the body or just a mixture of products. So, nonetheless, you know, I always have faith in Victoria, um, the owner, and I purchased the Valentine's Day box, and I'll probably purchase every box after that. I even purchased one for my friend because I had got her the January box, and I just felt like... She wasn't able to really understand why we get so excited about the boxes because it was totally a face box. So I went ahead and um, purchased a Valentine's Day box because I'm like, you know, she'll really get to understand why we love cream and cocoa. Like why we like be waiting outside the door for our boxes to arrive, you know. So I think the box, I want to say it was 30 bucks. Um, but I, I really felt like it was worth it and I always feel like it's worth it. Like I think her boxes will be worth it forever. I said the same thing about Curl Kit, but clearly I was wrong. However, Victoria, I feel like she just sits around all day brainstorming. I mean, the names of the items. I mean, the way they feel. It's awesome. And for those of you that got a box, you guys know what I'm talking about. And for those of you that didn't get a box, you guys are just going to be jealous, okay? And you're going to wish that you purchased a box. Because she actually put some extra boxes up, I think yesterday or the day before, and everybody went and got them. Because they were trying to act hard and not purchase anything else from her, but they just could not resist. Because she's that good. So, enough talking. Let's get on to the February Hot Cocoa Box. The special edition box, okay? So first, we have the Bourbon Cream Brulee. And it says, massage the frosting onto skin and hair for rich moisture treatment. Warm the butter in your hands for a relaxing massage um, or ease tired muscles. Use daily on skin and as needed in hair. And so it was kind of like below freezing today. But this is what it looks like. Okay. And it smells, I mean, delightful. Very delightful. And so I'll just put that on. I mean, look at that. Just cream a creamy. Oh my god. Okay. So let's stop getting so excited. Um next now you guys once again this was another product she put it in a box about three months ago and i was like ew what's that literally threw it in my bedroom on the floor never to touch again the other day i pulled it out and rubbed it on my skin i said oh mm, smells good soft skin shining it was the peach cobbler lotion bar and now i want to buy billions so guess what lo and behold we get another one okay and this one is a pomegranate mocha massage truffle a creamy massage butter bar to soften and sweeten drizzled with raw cacao liqueur okay awesome love it cannot wait it smells so good i can smell the hint of pomegranate okay now this is another thing that I really was not into and didn't really care about until I got it in another box. Okay, this is the Coconut Macaroon soft, Softening Lip Taffy. This is what it looks like. And you just put it on your lips. I have lipstick on or I will put it on. And it's a nourishing intense lip treatment with a warm coconut flavor. So yes, I mean, definitely you can smell the hints of cocoa. 
Now next, and I love my candles, okay? You guys know I have my top five places I get my candles from. That's what I do. Bam. Almond biscotti, okay? And it says it's a botanical massage candle. Creamy vegan candle blended with natural soy wax, cocoa butter, and botanicals to soften and smooth skin or burn for relaxation. Light the candle, blow out once a small pool of melted oils form, use caution, and dip fingers in the warm wax. This smells delightful and I can't wait to try this out like as a massage candle that is. Love it. This might be my favorite item besides the lotion bar, okay? And then we have the Marshmallow Truffle, which is an edible warming massage glaze. And you can just throw it in the microwave and warm it up. And then um, you can, it says, it's an antioxidant rich raw cacao infused natural oils. Blend with organic honey, creating an intensely hydrating hair and body massage oil that's just as sweet as it's softening massage on wet or dry skin and enjoy the light euphoric fragrance of chocolate and vanilla below on the skin after apply for a gentle warming sensation can be applied to the hair for a nourishing treatment and it's sealed so i don't really want to open that right now um and last but not least okay for your JJ, and i know some of you guys you know no nothing down there except just water and just you keep it regular but you were able to choose either the pink cookie or the honey pot which are both the JJ soaps and I got the pink cookie because I do love this one I actually have one in my bathtub right now so and it's lightly scented I don't even think it's scented um and so I I, I do love this bar so this was just perfect to go along with Valentine's Day. So all in all, like I said, great box. The things are edible. I probably won't try to eat them. However, I will try the massage candle. Um, and like I said, I can definitely vouch for her lotion bars. They're awesome. I know the candle. I mean, it smells just like almond. That will be great. I already used the pink cookie, so I know that will be awesome. And this um, creme brulee, nice and creamy. Okay. So once again, I'm going to ask. Now, do you see why I said the people that didn't purchase this box are jealous? Because Victoria is on her stuff. Okay? On her stuff. So, that concludes this video. Please let me know your thoughts. Are you one of the lucky ones that didn't get a box and now you're wishing you did? Or are you one of the people that had faith and purchased the box after, you know, after the face box that we got for January? Let me know your thoughts. I can't wait to hear them. Bye.